has come to our family. You remember our venerable house? Opulent and imperial, gazing proudly from its stoic perch above the moor. I lived all my years in that ancient, rumor-shadowed manor, fattened by decadence and luxury. And yet I began to tire of conventional extravagance. Singular unsettling tales suggested the mansion itself was a gateway to some fabulous and unnameable power. With relic and ritual, I bent every effort towards the excavation and recovery of those long-buried secrets, exhausting what remained of our family fortune on swarthy workmen and sturdy shovels. At last, in the salt-soaked crags beneath the lowest foundations, we unearthed that damnable portal of antediluvian evil. Our every step unsettled the ancient earth. But we were in a realm of death and madness. In the end, I alone fled laughing and wailing through those blackened arcades of antiquity. Until consciousness failed me. You remember our venerable house. Opulent and imperial. It is a festering abomination. I beg you, return home, claim your birthright, and deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadows of the darkest dungeon. Darkest Dungeon is about making the most of a bad situation. Quests will fail or must be abandoned. Heroes will die, and when they die, they stay dead. Progress autosaves constantly, so actions are permanent. The game expects a lot of you. How far will you push? Thank you. I was attempting to read that. But no then. This is Darkest Dungeon. <coughs> As it explained itself, a game of making the best out of the worst. As I am now trying to make the best out of the fact it stole the very text from before my eyes. Oh well, it cannot be helped. We are starting a new game here. With the Crimson Court DLC obtained. I have not played this in about half a year, but I should be able to do something about it. All DLCs active. Yes. Well, let's get on with it. Radiant campaigns, while still challenging, are adjusted to be faster and more forgiving than normal. Suggest your first Darkest Dungeon experience. No, I don't think so. Darkest. Normal campaigns are the original settings for the game. While there is no time limit to win, the campaign will be longer and more challenging than Radiant mode. I'll accept that. Blood Moon campaigns are not for the faint of heart. Expect no quarter, no forgiveness. You must conquer the evil within a time and hero death limit. Hmm... No, I do not think this is the one we are going for. Let's pick Darkest. And the name of the venerable house is Vensor. I bet the moment you knew I had to name this, you saw this coming. You will arrive along the old road. 
It winds with a troubling serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside. Leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient pitted cobbles of the old road. And on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. So steel yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. The old road. With the stagecoach destroyed and the caretaker gone, you will have to make the journey to the hamlet on foot. That is what we shall be doing now. Right, so here we have map navigation has not changed. Reynold and Dismas, the classic starter duo. Brigands have run up these lanes. Keep to the side path. The hamlet is just ahead. Dispatch this thug in brutal fashion, that all may hear of your arrival. Oh, I will. It would be my pleasure. Decimated. Yep, this these expedition are at least promises success. The same as before. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. All right, leave that nothing looks... unchecked. There is much to be found in forgotten places. An ambush. Send these vermin a message. The rightful owner has returned, and their kind is no longer welcome. And this grants. 12 HP. So this attack would be. Quite a 10 minus 25%. Ah, yeah, the damages are there. 4 to 8. Well, this... I'll take the tracking shot on them. Since the preparatory round and all. So you got 50% stun resistance. Hmm. I'll be using this one. Inspiration and improvement. That wasn't exactly what was wanted. Well, might as well put the big guy to bleed in. And swap the crusade over there. Should have just done the grape shot blast, but uh, I'll just fix that next round. Right, the blood letters also giving in. Exposed to a killing blow. Okay, it's only getting worse. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. When the, when the most ones die, they leave corpses. Corpses have temporary obstacles. Yeah, these were there last time. Can attack corpses. Push-pull skills. Corpse clearing special skills. 
killed with bleed, blight or crits, leave no corpses at all. Uh, right now the corpse is not that important. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. After you complete requirements of a quest, you have the option to return to town at any time. Just click the crest, you don't need to return the starting room. Yes. Hmm, there's this chest here. Man is trapped chest. Something doesn't look quite right with this one. Alright, we are ignoring it then. Both heroes are now level 1, no traits. Afflictions are removed by placing a hero in any stress treatment activity. Welcome home, such as it is. This squalid hamlet, these corrupted lands, they are yours now, and you are bound to them. Very well. Or any any screen in the game, press and hold H to see health. All right. Graveyard. Most will end up here, covered in the poisoned earth, awaiting merciful oblivion. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. So here we can watch this. Yeah, up. And then there's... Women and men, soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. All will find their way to us now that the road is clear. Yep. And then we could... Stagecoach... Currently we are not even close to the limit, so I'll just upgrade the network. And so I got to recruit the these two. Pious and unrelenting. Ah yes, it's suggesting me to do just that. Can't now though. Saving some of the things since I shouldn't really spend them willy-nilly. We have much more to do in town right now. Time to embark on a quest. Yep. A mecca of madness and morbidity. Your work begins. Probably should put them like this. Red hook, the usual suspects. Ah, uh, tricky glory, and this isn't even anything. Guess certain combinations in certain spots, giving names to it. All right. This isn't the mad realm of your fallen ancestor. Take note of how the creatures are taken over, but don't delve too far. A short scouting mission. Let's go for that. The cost one. of preparedness, measured now in gold, later in blood. Yes, yeah, supplies at least eight food and four torches on a short mission. So, same to fill one spot with those. And a few extra torches. Hmm, wonder what this is. Haven't seen it before. Oh well. Two skeleton keys if I happen to run into loot. One more holy water because why not? And two shovels as to not run into things I cannot get through. That should be good, I think. Your first expedition into the ruins of your ancestry. Be curious, be careful. We'll do so. We'll do so. Ah, oh, the map seems simple enough. Good, good. Right, so there's an unburnt torch. Yes, sure, why not? It's 
still rather light out here. Ah, you didn't... You don't really have attacks from there. Well, let's stun that guy. Let's see. Yep, got both heals. Real good, real good. Don't need them right now, though. Probably won't need that either, so... Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Let's just deal as much damage as we can. Back to the pit. Yep, that's that fight over and done with. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. So I can reduce torch to increase loot, but we are uh, we have extra torches. There we go. Unlock strong box. Would a skeleton key do any more? No, it didn't do anything more. A shame. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Oh, scouting. It's going to be a fight soon, so we'll probably have to put up the torch again. Let's see here. Ah, this is why I brought Even shovels. The cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. And we should be running into fight right about now. Right now I can get someone. Let's see. Should have a good chance of stunning that person. There we go. Now... No undead bonus damage, so... Let's just go for the Caldist Acolyte that not everyone can strike at. That's some good damage right there to everyone if it hits. I could pull off an Accusation with a chance to kill, or I could just smite for the kill. I'll pull off the smite, so... Be gone, fiend. Yep. That, that skeleton looked more threatening to me. Incoming plague grenade. But there we go. Another one falls. And that knife deals more damage than the pistol, so... As victories mount, so too will resistance. So here we have a room battle with Kirio, and here a room battle with treasure. Let's go get the treasure first. Ah, loot in the back. More skeleton keys. Good. Room battle. Yeah, better put the torch up. So we'll surprise them. No blight. A shame. Let's take that Another undead out of there. Cleansed from our lands. Hmm. That that Eldritch push is a friend for the old god. That puts bleed we onto the heroes. Well, let's clear the corpses. That's quite a bit of stress, and that's why I need to get rid of that enemy. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. 
Although that's going to hurt on the will to fight falters. Hmm. We have to move the Vestal back to have heals ready later. Should probably just. Nah. I'll try to kill it fast so it won't have the chance to. Whew. Already getting worried that might hurt. Right. Now they are bleeding as well, and here we have the heal. Right, let's salvage this situation. Yep, as the that's enemy the crumbles. enemy dead. Bandages. Mm, that low and is, driven into the mud. is not that important to heal as of now. Heirloom chest, well did this take keys? Yeah, so this took keys. Right. So next off would be heading this way. Ah, uh, that's not Mind too nice. That such missteps are the exception. Hmm. And Our plague doctor's getting pretty stressed out. But since we are to explore most of the rooms, ambushed that by foul invention. We'll be running out of torch. Should bring more next time around. Right, so let's try to shuffle this armless guy so he'll be less of a threat. There we go. Some solid damage on everybody. And might as well heal a lot. Abatement. They are ganging up on Reynold. Let's deal with the Arbalest here. That was a nice attack. Well, more disorienting blast then. Just for the stun value. And then the open vein to perhaps for the kill. Executed and there we go. Outmatched indeed. And then smite. As the falls. Ah, oh, that worked out pretty well. Holy fountain. Wobadon, you might need the help. Give it some holy water. Healing and stress relief. Yep, that was what we were looking for. So there's nothing. Let's go check this curio out. Wait a second, what are you doing? Wealth beyond measure, awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Hey, you didn't have that trait when we got on this mission. Why do you have it now? Not okay. Well, a fight has appeared in this here hallway. Well, let's deal with it then. That's a big fight, I'll have to say. Alright. Blight grenades incoming. Confusion. Nerves. And stress per round. That's new. I got to get rid of that madman real quick. As well as that cast over there. Since while the bleed does damage, damage we can deal with, stress is harder. Almost. Well, the next grape shot blast is going to clear that out. Continue the onslaught. Uh, had Destroy. 
them all. Had they not dodged that? Uh, let's see. More plague, yeah sure, why not? That should kill the madman. And... Yeah, heal more. Might as well. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. I'll be agreeing with Ancestor on that one. Oh. Reeling. About to break. No bleed at the very least. More blight incoming. Well, that missed. Take the shot. Okay, we are not hitting that one. That we are not. Well, they are almost fixing the party order. More heals. Outlast them. Okay, so this accusation is going to kill them if it hits, so I might as well try to clear the corpse with it. Pathway done. And luckily that one was a bit better of a shot. Ooh. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. I like it. Oh, and return to the default party order, if you would. So there should not be a fight in this hall. Reynold, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Come on. Well, you take some healing there, and you can have one, despite your best attempts to sabotage your fellow party members. Ah, Alright, and have a common meal too, why not? We are nearly done exploring the entire place, so I'm just going to be a bit on the greedy side and see if we cannot make it. Pitch black is sort of scaring me, but let's see if we find anything good here. Well, we found a fight, if nothing else. Right, so monsters have bonus accuracy and damage. But at least the surprise effect did not happen, so we should be good to go. Double Blight, excellent. That guy's now dying on his own. That guy not as much. Grievous oh, injury. critical. Palpable fear. Alright, now we got to put a singular bigger heal on that guy. Excellent. Unnerved. Unbalanced. And immediately on the death's door. Not as excellent, I'll have to admit. I'll just take the damage source out of the game. Not dead. Not dead yet. More plague to the back rows. Alright, that guy's dying on his own. So no more attention is to be given to that one. Alright, just since we cannot really get him out of the range, let's just heal everyone and give him the buffer point so he won't die. So he's dying on his own anyhow, so let's focus some more damage on this defender fellow. Right. Yep. Dead, blights, blights it good, this status is effect. Life is taken. Doesn't really matter, but let's throw this out not to stress the doctor further. And that's the final cut. The blood. This expedition at least promises success. 
The blood is a special type of supply item. Any collected bottles of the blood will be retained in your estate at quest end. They may be added to the provisions of embargoing parties. The blood is rare. Spray it around wisely amongst those in need. So, the blood. The call is unyielding. The urge is irresistible. Only the blood will quell that thirst. Well, I can leave the medicinal herbs behind, since they are just a supply them, would be sold away. And the key gives us... So we don't currently have space for that. These are worth 250, Yeah, I can get rid of that. I should have thrown away the food. Well, too late now. Quest is completed. That's a lot of crests. And Dismas has obtained skilled gambler. While well, we have here we have claustrophobia and world tactician on Vobadon. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. We have successfully completed our first foray into the ruins, and here we have all the bosses. The assaults on Darkest Dungeon. Yep. We have opened Tavern and Abbey, the stress relief locations. But we'll get to them uh, the next time around. If this sort of a bit more strategic and unforgiving gameplay is up to your alley, we already had a close one and that was just a tutorial mission. Well, expect this series to continue one episode per week. Until next Thursday, the dungeon can await a bit more.